According to District Attorney Henry Wade, there are more than 150 so-called masseuses in Dallas County who really work as prostitutes. The county commissioners asked for suggestions from Wade and Sheriff Clarence Jones as to how massage prostitution can be controlled. Jones proposed a licensing procedure. Under this plan, the masseuses and the parlors would have to obtain licenses to run their businesses. Theoretically, the county could then prevent illicit sex by controlling the parlor licenses. But District Attorney Wade says the county does not have the constitutional power to make massage prostitution a penal offense. The only way the county could prosecute such cases, Wade says, is if the state passes legislation against illicit massage. And he adds that massage legislation probably couldn't become effective until next September. The district attorney's office could take prostitutes working at existing parlors in Dallas County to court, but it doesn't have evidence against them. Evidence could be obtained easily, but it would mean assigning sheriff's officers to an investigation. So far, the sheriff's department hasn't been able to spare the manpower for that. Byron Harris, Channel 8 News.